Hi, welcome back. The folks at Helltech invited me to check out the Mesh Pocket Power Bank. It's a QI2 MagSafe charger with Mesh-tastic baked into it. So this makes the perfect off-grid tool. Figure you have no cell signal, but you got mesh. So you can keep your cell phone charged with this device. So you can use your cell phone to send messages using the Mesh-tastic node that's baked into this power bank. This is the 5,000 mAh unit. There is a 10,000 mAh option. A lot of fine print on the back. We're going to talk about this. QI2 compatibility supports 5 watt, 7 watt, 10 watt, and 15 watt wireless charging. To recharge the battery, supports 9 volt 2.2 amp and 5 volt 3 amp. Okay, user guide. Wow, look at that. So the case is made out of ABS plastic, and that's tempered glass on the <laughs> on the surface here. Wow, that's great. You can see mesh tastic. All right, reset and user button. There's that MagSafe charging. Other cool features are this allows simultaneous charging and discharging. A lot of power banks won't let you do that. And it enables both wireless discharge and you can charge via the USB-C port at the same time. Of course, there's all kinds of voltage protection. This is the NRF52840 BLE with SX1262 LoRa. 2.13 inch e-ink display. Obviously, uh, custom firmware support. So there's your firmware connection. Yeah, there's the firmware connection cable, and this is your charging cable here. So this is the Mesh Pocket QI2 Magnetic Charging Power Bank Mesh Tastic Compatible Product page. You have the option of the 5000 mAh or 10,000 mAh, and you have color choice, yellow or gray. I think yellow is going to be easier to spot in the wild. And then, of course, you have your LoRa band options. And I'm going to go with the 902 to 928 megahertz. And that comes in at $69. Look for the link down below. I also have a special discount code in the description. Oh, look at that. I'm charging. <laughs> wow, that's great. Yeah, so you can see where this is going to work great in an off-grid scenario. You know, we got a charging cable. My thought with this device, oh, how sweet. Got an extra USB-C cable for charging. Another charge cable. Cool pouch here. I didn't see that one. I can feel there's some sort of magnetic grip in here. Too. I'm, I'm really thrilled to work with this. What I want to do is I want to run this down to the minimum and I want to charge it using one of my solar panels and then I want to see if I can charge my phone successfully in that scenario. I want to do the perfect off-grid and you know I'm equipped for it because of course I have a whole bunch of different solar panels I can test this with. I really want to try this in sort of an off-grid test. I want to wear the power pack down charging my phone. I want to recharge the power pack. And of course, I want to use Mesh Tastic and see if I can get on the mesh with this device. So stay tuned.